Are you and your boyfriend still together? What's up, YouTube? It's your girl Kayla back on Vibe with K. I want you to myself, won't share you with nobody else. Label me a stingy nigga, something I can't help. Yeah, fresh out the Vicky, we can play the cause you dealt. I go flow with the video. I'm gonna be doing a QA video. I've been holding down on questions and just holding down on this video in general. I want to um, answer a lot of questions that I've been getting asked very, very frequently, and I'm here to answer them all. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe down below, and turn on your bell notifications. I've been looking at my analytics lately, and it shows that half of you guys are subscribed, but if you are subscribed, you do not have your notifications on. So make sure you guys hit that notification bell so you can get notified every time I upload a video. Let's just get started. The first question is, how old are you? I'm 16 years old at the moment. My birthday is August 23rd, and I will be turning 17 on August 23rd. How many siblings do you have, and who is your favorite? Sorry, can't think of nothing. Um, I don't have a favorite sibling, and I have two brothers and three sisters. What are you mixed with? P.S. I love your channel, and can you please do more hair videos? Yes, I definitely do plan on doing more hair tutorials and hair videos on here in general. I just feel like I don't do that enough on here, so I'm definitely going to be doing that for you guys. I just need you guys to give me ideas down below. I am mixed with black and Panamanian. My dad is fully black and my mom is black and Panamanian. Her mom is black and her dad is, I think, full Panamanian. So that's where I get that from. What is your dream job? At the moment, like my job, like things that I wanna do in the future have been shifting. Um, at the moment, what I really wanna do, I haven't really even talked about this just because it's been on my mind and I don't know if I'm for sure like thinking about doing this, but I'm pretty confident that this is for me. Um, I want to be an entrepreneur, open my own hair care line and just stuff like that because I love the things that I'm doing now and I feel like to take that to the next step would be to like open up my own business and just stuff that has to do with hair because I really enjoy learning about hair, learning like the history about hair and just how like curly hair works and all of that stuff. So I do want to open my own business and I hope to, not even hope, I will. We're just gonna speak that into existence. So yeah. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is red. What would you want your future to look like in 10 years? People always tend to ask these type of questions in Q and A's, but I wanna be like my own boss. Like I wanna do my own thing. Like I don't wanna work for somebody else. I think that's just, I just wanna do me, you know? I want to open my own hair care line. Um, you know, just do entrepreneur things and just make it, you know, grow and just do everything on my own and not have handouts and just be able to learn new things about hair and I have some other things planned but I don't want to say that because I want to do it and not just talk about it you know how to start a YouTube channel I mean when people ask this question it's just like I don't know how to, how to like answer that basically most of it starting a YouTube channel is just first off figuring out what you want to post what kind of camera do you have I have the Canon G7X and I film my regular videos on here. Um, people tend to film, what do they film? Oh, they tend to film vlog videos on the Canon G7X, but I film my regular videos just because it's a small camera and it's really good to start off. And it's, I mean, it's expensive, but that is the least you're gonna get when it comes to good quality and having a good camera just to start off because all the other cameras going from the Canon G7X and up is just gonna get even more pricey. Can you make any room in your house a place to do YouTube? Personally, for me, no. I liked my background to be professional and just clean all around. So before I was filming on this wall, I always had to clean my room just before, um, before I filmed because I noticed that when you're on social media and you're on YouTube, people can see every little thing. Like, you can be in your bathroom they'll see a little spider crawling like 
they pay attention to every little thing so you want to make sure you have like a clean and good background and not just film anywhere if that makes sense because you need to have good lighting and stuff because if you don't have the good lighting or a more professional place um people won't really watch your video unless it's like a funny video because anything just trends nowadays so it doesn't really matter about the background but to me it personally matters what do you want to do after high school after high school i do want to go to college um that's one thing i do want to like go to college for business because i want to be an entrepreneur but i'm not too sure like what particular route i want to go in when it comes to business i've been doing my research there's a lot of like branches when it comes to business like you could say you want to do business but then there's like marketing then there's like some other other stuff like, that I don't even know. There's some other stuff that I don't even know. So I'm doing my research trying to figure out what is best for me and what do I actually like. Cause I don't want to do a job or anything that I don't like. Can you drop tips for YouTube channels? I am gonna make a full on video on tips on how to grow. I definitely know how it is to be at square one because I did not get handouts. Nobody did not shout out my YouTube channel. I basically did all of this on my own and I know how hard it is to be at 1,000 subscribers just to get to 50K or like, well, wherever I am now, you know? And it's not that easy because I've been doing YouTube for so long, but you have to actually enjoy it to like keep going, you know? If you don't enjoy it and you're trying to do it for the money, then it's not gonna, this is, YouTube is not for you. Are you a Christian? Yes, I'm a proud Christian. Can you do more vlogs and get ready with me? Yes, I do love to do get ready with me and vlogs. I just can't do them since quarantine, but I'm gonna try my best to do those. What do you love most about yourself? Honestly, it would have to be like my smile or my hair. I really do love my hair and I embrace it because when I was younger, I liked my hair, but I didn't know how to take care of it so now that I know how to take care of it I'm embracing my hair and I want that to be for other girls that are watching me too because I've been through a time where I wanted to straighten my hair because I've seen other girls at my school straighten their hair and that's one big thing that I want to get across my channel is for you to embrace your natural hair even no matter what your hair type is are you and your boyfriend still together are we hmm. yes we are still together it's not like I've been hiding it it's just like kind of private you know um but yes we are still together and we will be filming YouTube videos together soon I get that question all the time every time I do a little poll on Instagram or anything or like where you guys get to ask me questions that is the main one that's on there so yes we are still dating at the moment we are still talking dating whatever you want to call it we're still together and yeah what's your favorite hairstyle to do my favorite hairstyle to do would have to be the puff I love my high puff like it's just an easy hairstyle to do and my other favorite hairstyle to do is a middle part slick back my middle part slick back be crucial if y'all want that tutorial I can give it to you I can give you a, a middle part slick back with a bun or I can give you a middle part slick back with like a big puff because my big puffs be oof. What made you want to do YouTube and what made you want to do hair videos on IG? Um, when it came to YouTube, my mom suggested me doing singing videos. I started off doing singing videos. Later on, I thought I was good, but it was not the move. Um, I just ended up like having fun with YouTube, just recording, just doing me. So. With YouTube, it was just like a natural thing, just doing it, just because I like to. And then I actually like felt like people were kind of supporting me when I had like a thousand followers. I was so, I mean, a thousand subscribers. I was so happy. So yeah, it just kept sticking with me. Um, in hair videos on IG, at the time I was transitioning with heat damage, so that definitely like, I don't know. I seen Drake Godez. I don't know if you guys know her. Um, she actually inspired me to do hair videos and once I've been watching hair videos I was like I want to do this too and 
it just took off from there so i'm really glad she started doing hair videos because that inspired me and i hope i inspire you too um but yeah she inspired me to do hair videos and i just ended up going from there but that just took off like you know you guys seemed to like it so i just kept doing it and it was like really fun for me because that's when i started to love my hair and embrace it and now i just can't stop doing it and i want others to embrace their hair too so that's just like my main thing so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up subscribe down below to be a part of the vk gang because if you're not the gang you is lame period so make sure you guys subscribe follow me on my socials and turn your bell notification on once again if you are a new subscriber or an old subscriber if you're watching this in general turn your bell notification on whichever side it's on you know which side it's on i don't so only you could do it only you could do it um yeah if you guys want another q a just make sure to um comment that down below i can give it to you guys i don't know if you guys like them because they all they are is just people talking so i didn't know if you guys would get irritated by it but yeah so i'll see you guys in my next video bye I didn't make you go and do anything. Try to make that ass cut, she don't need no applause. High fashion, like go, yeah.